Yo, it's Rick here, and uh, got another 2021-2022 Bowman U hobby box. Obviously, Stroud had another solid game. Not as good as the last one, but uh, yeah, definitely had a good, solid game. And he's the guy. He is the guy, what can I say? So we're chasing him again, obviously. Um, just, once again, another slew of great names in this product in general i know it's unlicensed i know it's college um but uh i don't it doesn't bother me i know people are looking in mosaic for stroud but i'd rather have the autograph in my opinion that's that's just me like even unlicensed i would rather have his first autograph um i don't know that's that's just my opinion I saw a tweet about Will Levis's uh, one of one uh, super fractor going for like 6k or went for 6k. Um, let me put this down a little bit. And people were like, oh, throw it in the trash. It's worthless. It's 6, 6k on that. Which it's Will Levis, like, right? You're, you're taking a chance. But like, people were, <clears throat> I mean, they were talking about the player, obviously. But they were also talking about the cars, like, oh, <laughs> throw it away, put it in the dumpster. I'm like, uh, sheesh, guys. Like, I don't know. I don't mind it whatsoever. Um, you're not going to find their autographs in many other products, to be honest. So, like, you know, I mean, it wasn't the autograph one. It was just the one of one uh, non autograph version but uh yeah people seem to really like dislike college uh products at least for football uh basketball it seems like a different story um with basketball it seems like everybody was on the victor wimbenyama or however you say it wimby um, seems like everybody's fine with it. Maybe because it was a short print or something. Um, maybe he's just a bigger star than a CJ Stroud or, you know, a Bryce Young or anybody else, possibly. Um, but, yeah. Well, let's see what we got here. Looking a little. One second. Alrighty, we're back. Sorry about that. But yeah, it, it's it's very interesting how uh, how things are. I'd say, <clears throat> right? Because obviously, baseball it's about the first. Um, you know, basketball seems to be a little bit more accepting of it, from what I notice. Uh, this could be an autograph. Um, football is just. Does not like it at all, which is pretty interesting. I wonder if that will ever change. I, I don't mind college stuff. College stuff is all right with me. Ooh, just a Dalton Kincaid. I mean, that wouldn't have been a bad autograph to get. First uh, refractor there. Um, I don't know. I just find that pretty interesting how... Uh, um, you know, how it all unfolds and, and all that good stuff. Seems like we got a lava here, possibly. Yeah, a refractor lava right there. Got Jake Hayner is on the Saints, I'm pretty sure. Bijan, RJ Sneed. This probably be an autograph. It looks like Desmond Ritter. Tyler Van Dyke. Oof. Tyler Van Dyke is our numbered card. Rough one. Our numbered autograph, I should say. So we're going to get a base one. Um, after that, that's that's a little stinker. That is... That's a rough one. Personally, not who I'm looking for. A lot of quarterbacks, though. In this... In these here. Um, obviously, you know, we're looking for CJ Stroud. Hopefully, we at least get a low number card of his... Hopefully it's not too rough of a box. Um, my first box was okay. I mean, most people wouldn't like it. But personally, as a Texans fan, 
pulled a bunch of PC stuff and uh, not too bad quarterback um, parallel numbered card. I was hoping this one was better, but uh, starting off a little rough. Hopefully, looks like we got another aqua or green here. Looks looks like an aqua. Got Jalen Watson right there. John Mechie. First of Nick Starkle. Pulling this guy quite a bit. I feel like... Then we get a number card. or We got something of his last time. Maybe it was just a plain old refractor or something. Old Nick Starkle. But yeah. The first one in general was pretty fun to open. I, I have fun with these. I think Bowman is fun. Especially these two years. The star and then 2022 Bowman Uchrome. Uh, just because... Well, to be honest, all the all the good hits weren't in the breaker options. They were actually in the hobby box. I don't think Bowman Uchrome had breaker stuff. Uh, 2022. Um, got a refractor in here. It is a little unfortunate. I feel like 2023 Bowman U does take a hit. Not autograph. Rakeem Jarrett. That name sounds... Pretty familiar. I am not going to lie. Is this a... I don't think... I don't think that's a... Image variation. Because it wouldn't have the first Bowman. But yeah. I think... I think... Personally for me... 2023 suffers from having a breaker option. Even though anybody can buy it. Um... It feels like all the low numbered hits were in that. Um and if you look at the odds, man, it's 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 pretty crazy how how good the odds are, are for those boxes in particular. Stingley? Another another Stingley autograph. Okay, all right. Hey, it looks like we're building up the Stingley autograph rainbow here. Got the base. Got the other one. Spoiler alert. Stingley was in that other box. Okay, <laughs> we'll take it. I mean, I'm not gonna complain about that. Uh, probably got what one more number card in here. Oh man, that's funny. We will take it. We're getting close. We are getting close. CJ Stroud is gonna come out of one of these. If not, then uh, we'll keep trying. Cause I'm I'm committed to buying or to buying, but uh, pulling a CJ Stroud card. Looks like we got our one unnumbered shimmer Penix. Gonna be a first. Like Bryce Young. That's who I thought it was, just from the helmet. There we go. A little Bryce Young action right there. Got quite a bit of print lines, but. Overall, I, I like the designs of these, or at least this year's uh, set. Um, 2022 was okay. Um, I really think just 21 was just really solid overall. Rodriguez. Move these a little bit closer so I can get them a little easier. Don't got to struggle reaching around. Might have another chrome card in here. You can kind of feel if these these are thick or not. We got a little Zay Flowers. My Jay Sanders. Nothing too special in that one. All paper. Alrighty. Oh, it looks like we got our Invicta here. Yeah, I believe there's only three cards in these. Because just how thick they are. My Jay Sanders, which is actually on the Texans as well. Hamilton, Chris Olave. Oh, it's not too bad. Dang, this one's bowing out. That's a little crazy because these, these things are a little thick. I'm surprised to see that happening. Chris Olave. 
not too shabby struggling to get inside the uh, tight sleeve there. Let's see if we can pull something low number. That would be nice. Another re refractor here. Watermeyer, Mertz, CJ Stroud, and DeMarvin Leal, which actually sounds really familiar as well. San Antonio, Texas. We need to go to AM then. That's what it looks like. Um, we'll just put it up there. Marvin Leal. Name sounds super familiar. Brian Robinson. Chris Olave. CJ Stroud on the insert there. Kate Otten. Place for the Buccaneers. Actually got an autograph of his as well from a blaster box. Stingley following us around. I won't complain too much about the Stingley following us around. Uh, he did come back and play this past Sunday. Um, I think they're slowly easing him in. Uh, he definitely probably needs to get back into the flow of things. Notre Dame. Kyle Hamilton. He's alright for Baltimore. Not too shabby. If I can... There we go. There we go. A little bit easier this time. Yeah. I wouldn't say as good as a box. I guess we'll see. We'll wait for our uh, our our other parallel here. Can you pick it? I'm not gonna lie. There's you know Steeler fans. I I respect y'all for for uh, you know hanging around. I guess I should say um, they really believe in Kenny Pickett, <clears throat> and uh, that's. That's Bryce Young again on the refractor. We'll take that all day, every day. Um, looks a little messed up right there. A little ding-ish right there. That's all right. These aren't. These aren't worth, worth much, anyways. Um, it's just nice to get. Um, but yeah, back to the Kenny Pickett thing. I'm not gonna. I don't believe in that guy whatsoever. But I respect. The Steelers fans for sitting in there and being like, yeah, this is our quarterback. He's the best, even though he's he's a quarterback. That's what, I, that's what I'm going to say. I'm just going to say he is a quarterback. <laughs> oh, man. Looks like is that. What is that? Is that a it's not a big kahuna, is it? That's I think that's a big kahuna right there or something. Yeah, it is. Hey, look. First case hit. We will take it. Come on, CJ Stroud. Big Kahuna. CJ Stroud. That looks like a white helmet. Bijan Robinson. Yes, sir. All right. We'll take it. Way off centered. But hey, Bijan Robinson, big Kahuna case hit. We will take that all day, every day. Oh, my goodness. Like I said, Pretty off centered, but hey, Texas. I mean, I'm a UT fan as well. If if y'all didn't know, um, hey, this is a good box. Good box. I think we still got our number card, which might be in here, unless I already pulled it and I just breezed right by it. I didn't, you know, <clears throat> pay attention to it. But hey, first case hit uh, a little Bijan action. We will take that. We will take that. Sadly, the Falcons don't know how to use them. But, uh, yeah, maybe this still, still feels a little thin. So, yeah, maybe we just, maybe I just forgot. Maybe it was just, or maybe because we got a case hit. But uh, let's go through the recap real quick. Be right back. All right, we're back here for the recap. I got to say, these are a ton of fun. Like, even the autographs weren't the greatest. Still got a PC autograph. But, you know, the parallel autograph wasn't the greatest. Um, it's still a lot of fun. These are just fun. Like, even though unlicensed college stuff, 
I mean, underrated, truly. Chris Olave right there, that's not too bad of one. DeMarvin Leal, Rakeem Jarrett, Dalton Kincaid. Got Bryce Young on the first. Bryce Young again on the first. We'll take that all day, every day. Nick Starkle. I'm not too sure how this kid is. I'm not going to lie. Um, I think I said that last time. Graduated from Texas. but uh, So not good. I probably said that last time too. <laughs> Big Kahuna. Brian Robinson. Brian Robinson. Excuse me. Let me put respect on B. John Robinson's name. I, I have no explanation. We're going to move past that. <laughs> Bijan Robinson on the Big Kahuna. I'll take that all day, every day. Derek Stingley Jr. on the autograph base. A little print line right there. It's a okay. Nothing wrong with that. A lava refractor out of 199 autograph. Tyler Van Dyke, which is uh, he's actually a freshman here. I don't know too much about him, but I uh, was hoping for somebody else, obviously, so... Anyways, uh, I hope y'all enjoyed. I had a ton of fun with this. This was fun. Got a case hit of B. John Robinson. Probably my favorite card. Just a ton of PC players for me, right? Personally, these two. Ton of PC players. You know, B. John, Xavier Worthy, Derek Singley, CJ Stroud, right? There's, there's just a ton. But yeah. Anyways, if you enjoyed this as much as I did, make sure to leave a like, subscribe, do all that good stuff. Comment down below what your thoughts is, and uh, maybe comment down go to look, comment down below what your thoughts on the first Bowman football situation since uh, it's a very interesting time period I'd say. But uh, yeah, anyways, taking too much of y'all's time. I appreciate y'all watching, appreciate y'all hanging out, appreciate everybody commenting. Uh, it's very fun to interact with y'all, and uh, yeah, catch y'all in the next one. Latest.